Well, I have the next project here. I grabbed a free pop-up camping trailer. I'm going to take it apart and make a utility trailer out of it. So I'm going to get to practice some of my welding skills, which I'm very bad at. Uh, and, you know, it's just fun. Uh, now, something that I want to do is also see about making a mobile solar project on top of this frame, but I don't, I'm not there yet. I still have to take the thing apart and uh, make any welds and any repairs that might be necessary. Now, since this is not the normal thing for this channel, let me know in the comments below if you want to see details about this project. Now, in preparation for this, I had to put a trailer hitch on my minivan, and I got that done a few months ago. Since then, I've been keeping my eye out for a free trailer. I have not even popped it open yet, so that's what I'm going to do next. But let me know in the comments if I should make a video about the teardown and turning this trailer into a utility trailer. Thanks a lot for watching. So this is a StarCraft, and it says 2,390 pounds on the GVW. Now the top is in bad shape. Oh, the spare tire looks pretty good though. Tree fell on it. It has this very odd pin connector, and so I didn't find any adapters for this. So I wound up getting a four pin, connecting this up in the guy's driveway. Oh, and here's the trailer hitch that I added. By the way, this is something that I did really early on. Right when I first bought the uh, van, I took out the seats that used to be here, and I turned this into a trunk compartment. We had a little passing thunderstorm. I covered the trailer up because I don't want a soggy mess to work with. I'm undoing these latches here. And a friend of mine told me to look for a crank in this box. A friend of mine has a StarCraft. So, let's see. Well, that looks like a mouse nest in there. <laughs> um, there we got a spider. Well, I guess I got a gas can in here and a wheel and a crank. Cool. Alright. It looks like we got some braces on here for the front bed. <laughs> lots and lots of holes in all the netting and canvas, but the step still works. <laughs> Okay, inside pan, we have a what looks like a twin bed over here, or a double maybe, smaller bed. In the front, it looks more like a queen, quite a bit bigger. There's a shelf that folded out in the front. Look at all the tear up of all that canvas. Uh, the cushions are in pretty good shape. Oh, look at the bed. So these cushions actually look pretty nice in comparison to maybe this bed. Over here we got what looks like a couple of circuit breakers and then a DC, like a 12 volt DC charger to keep the 12 volt battery topped off. We have a thermostat up here, heater, some kind of fridge, might just be a cooler for all I know, could just be Maybe just throw ice in there and got a little sink with a little pump. So basically I'm going to try to post and give away as much of this as I possibly can. Well, this is my buddy Jay and he's... How's it going? Jay, what are you uh, snagging so far? Oh, I'm stealing all your cushions. I'm definitely going to leave the ant's nest for somebody <laughs> else though. They probably might take this table, uh, maybe one of these lens covers. I think I got a broken one on mine. And what's the model that you're rehabbing? I am working on a... 
Starcraft Constellation Gemini, which <laughs> has a pull-out, slide-out side piece. Uh, it's a 2001-ish. Okay. If anybody has any parts, feel free to let me know. <laughs> oh, he's going to take these little latch things. <laughs> and uh, Jay and I met in the Army. And we did. Uh, yeah, we used to work together. Uh, actually... Fozzie was a mechanic, and I was uh, a small arms kind of guy, a component section repair person. Well, that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and check out the links in the description below and my Patreon page. That really helps me out uh, to allow me to buy some of the materials needed for some of these projects.